guys, welcome to my 33 week pregnancy vlog. I don't have a whole ton to update this week just because I haven't had my doctor's appointment yet. It's actually tomorrow. So I don't have any little ultrasound pictures or anything like that. However, I do have something new that I forgot to show last week. I got a new changing bag, which I'm really excited about. This is actually meant for, well, I don't know if it's meant for twins, but it's a lot bigger than the one that I had before. It's the Stork Sack Caroline. So before I had the Stork Sack Elizabeth, and I still have that one, and I could still use it if I wanted to, but this one is actually a lot bigger, like I said, and has so much more space in. So as we're going to have two under two, I'm gonna need space for two different sizes of nappies and you know changes of clothes, bibs, things like that. So at the moment it feels and looks really empty but I'm sure that when the baby is born it's all gonna change. So if you guys want, I will do an updated what's in my changing bag. Let me know if you want me to do one sooner rather than later or if you want me to wait until after the baby is born, um, which I probably will do anyway. I'll probably do an updated one if I do one now but I haven't done one of those in a while, so that might be cool. As far as weight gain goes this week, I stayed the same again. So I've gained 27 pounds so far. My symptoms for this week were lots and lots and lots of pressure. I feel like he's so low. Sometimes I really do see myself waddling when I walk. <laughs> like it's true what they say about pregnant women waddling because you just can't walk properly. Like you just feel like there is literally a head in between your two legs, which sounds gross, but that's how I feel just because he's so much lower than last time. And I was comparing pictures, Jonathan and I were comparing pictures of my bump with Amelia and my bump with this baby. And it's crazy how much lower he is than, than she was. So it's just so weird how I'm carrying a little bit different. I will say though, in the beginning, I used to look a lot bigger, like I, I got bigger much quicker. But now, when I compare the bump pictures, they're kind of evening out, like they kind of look almost almost the same. The other symptom that's been driving me crazy is lightning crotch. Just all of a sudden, like here and there, I'll just get a, it's like a bolt or a flash of lightning down there. And it's just when the baby hits a nerve, I think, or, you know, it's something like that. It's it's just basically nerves and it could just come out of nowhere and hit you like you feel like you just, I mean, I scream. The other thing that's been really tough though is mounting stairs, like doing kind of basic tasks. I'm really starting to get some backache and especially lower backache from picking things up and picking up Amelia. I know I've mentioned that before, but last pregnancy I didn't have like a baby or a toddler to pick up. so that's put more of a strain on my back because I don't remember this much back pain when I was pregnant with her the first time. So that's different. And then the shortness of breath, like I will just get that from even putting things up into like a cupboard <laughs> when I'm emptying the dishwasher or something, I get out of breath. Like I'm just like an old person. The baby apparently right now is the size of a pineapple, which I thought was really cool because that seems big. And he's kicking lots and he's hiccuping and doing all that kind of stuff, which is really cute. But the one thing that I will say, which I've mentioned before, is that he is lazy. So sometimes if he doesn't move for a while and I get worried and I prod my stomach, he won't react. Like he is just flat out asleep and he won't react. And it has, it freaked me out again this week. And I know it shouldn't, but it just does because you just worry. That's pretty much it for my update. I'm sorry it was so short, but like I said, I didn't have a doctor's visit. So if I get some pictures, I will share those on my blog. I will show you guys the bump now. This is the bump for 33 weeks on this side. I'll just show you guys. For once, I'm actually wearing jeans and not leggings, but these ones are really comfy. They're from ASOS. So that's from the front, from one side, and from the other side. And that's it. So that was my update for 33 weeks. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to check out my bump pictures on my blog, and I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.